Hi, my name is Neff, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to screen record. Like you want to do is set your tripod like this with your camera like this. Make sure. It's pointing down at the table you're going to be using, like this. And from here, you can head over to the smartphone. Now that you're at your smartphone, you want to head over to the Google Play Store and search for this app called AZ Screen Recorder. Right there, the first one should pop up, AZ Screen Recorder. You want to install it, but for me it says open, so I'm going to open it and show you some settings you need to put before screen recording. Right here in the corner, there should be a little, a little camera button. Click on that and click this button, the one that looks like a wrench. Click settings. And here you see a bunch of options the ones you need is video configuration click on the resolution and make sure it's set to 1920 by 1080 frame rate keep the same 60 fps but orientation keep it on auto don't worry about landscape or portrait now what you want is the audio configuration Make sure it's recording from the, the phone's internal microphone. Now, it says time recording. It shows you the recording duration, but I don't think you want that if you're screen recording. Here is a countdown value. Is a countdown before the, the screen recording happens. And don't worry about all these. Now, you can exit the app and click this button, but make, but make sure the, the orientation you want to record in is set like this. It's set in the portrait or landscape, because if you set it on portrait and then change it to landscape, it's not going to work. Now I'm gonna record my game. Now once you've imported your footage, you wanna select the main camera, the the tabletop, which is this one, first, and then you want the the smartphone footage to be overlapped like this. Now what you wanna do is highlight all of the f footages and right click and you see this that says synchronize and you want to click synchronize and it's analyzing so this might take a while and now here I'm going to show you how to fix this you want to click this button down at the bottom and you see right here. You want to right click, ripple delete, and you see right here. It's like a gap. I'm going to show you how you can fix it by doing this. By going like right here. And cutting it with shift and cut it. And you're seeing, and you're seeing, where's the, where's the tabletop footage at? I'm going to click on it. I'm going to click on this one. And click effects control right here. And now you see this button right here. Click on that. And it will resize it. Right here. You can resize it to any size you want. I'm going to put it right here in the corner. But smaller.
And now I'll show you the preview that it did it. And you see the footage right here is too long. So what I'm gonna do is is cut it like this. So that's it for this video guys, please like and subscribe for more how-to videos like these ones, bye.